What's up YouTube? Ryan back another card collecting video today. We're sorting through 500 more of my rookie cards, hoping to find some big name rookies. So this is part four to our video. I want to say part three is the most consistent we've had so far. So we'll see if part four can get some of those bigger names. Maybe some bows, some Yordans. I'm trying to think of rookies I wouldn't have in there. Maybe some Luke Voigt's from our this week's Cards Going Up video. is the number one video on there. So I know I have some of those somewhere, but maybe we'll find some of those bigger guys this week. We're going to start with the left stack as always. Try to go through this as fast as possible. If you guys like this video, you guys have rookie cards to sort as well. Give me a thumbs up on the video, helps me out my video a ton. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. We're almost at 2,300 subs, guys. It's kind of it's kind of nuts. Let's go through some rookie cards, see what we can find. All right, first stack up. Mejia, Alex Reyes, Jake Thompson, Carson Fulmer, Silver, Ian Happ. Put that to the side. I'm going to go on the right this time for cards I'm keeping. Shipley, Joe Jimenez, Silver, Jose De Leon, Franklin Barreto, Ryan Healy, Ian Happ again. I think I got a lot of Ian Happ in, in 2017. Kenta Maeda, Bowman's best rookie refractor. I'll put that aside. He's having a good year with the Twins. Wilson Ramos rookie card. Interesting. Peter Boros. Who's this? David Murphy. Tommy Murphy. I don't even know who that is. Carlos Santana. Is this a rookie card? Rookie debut. I'll put that to the side. It's pretty cool. He's been pretty good in the last few years. Kyle Freeland. Hey, look at there. Luke Voigt. I didn't even know he was in this. In this particular video. I know I've seen his rookie cards before. So, good timing on that. Joe Musgrove, Silver Montgomery. thought this dude was going to be a stud, but he's had some injury issues. Took him a long time to come back from Tommy John. That's a good one. DD rookie in the D-backs uniform. Never thought he'd be the player he is today, to be honest. Blake Snell, rookie debut slash rookie card. We got the RC on there. Jordan Montgomery, Chrome, Barreto, Lopez, Reyes, Brinson, Barreto, Amir Garrett, Jesse Winker. I'm going to put him aside just because he's having a really good year. Maybe something I should probably sell. Ian Happ Holiday. Cal Quantro, Ryan O'Hearn. David Fletcher. John Means. Rookie Refractor. Oh, wow. We got some football in here. All these silvers. Look at these. Josh Dobbs. I don't think he'll ever get the starting job or if he's even in the NFL anymore. Same with this guy, Davis Webb. And Malik Hooker. Yeah, I don't know anything about those guys. Naheem Hines. He's having a good start to the year with their first game. Bobby Bradley, Aaron Saval. Actually, Aaron Saval is disgustingly good, actually. So I'm going to put him aside. Gratterall. Jesus Lazardo, AJ Puck, Seth Brown. I like that one, too, actually. Hey, Zach Gallen. We had Nick Solak Green, but I'm not, I'm not big on Nick Solak. Zach Gallen, didn't even know. I thought I got all of his stuff out of this thing at one point or another. Look at that. Back to back. Jordan and Bo. That's awesome. See what kind of condition these cards are in. Looks like we got a corner messed up on uh, bottom right of both. <laughs> so, I mean, they look pretty good, to be honest, but they'd probably get nines if I was to grade them. Still cool. Big names. Trent Grisham. Is impressing me on a daily basis, but I'm gonna I'm gonna keep him in the the randoms. Maybe down the line I'll come back through and I'll be really excited. I left him in there. Dustin May. I kept all the Dustin Mays in there, so we're just gonna keep them there. Gavin Lux. I'm not big on Gavin Lux like some people are. Chris Paddock. I've been putting him aside, so might as well keep that trend going. Shed Long, Nate Low, Brandon Lau. Throw it in my PC pile that I've created of him. Andrew Tolles. Last stack of the first. See if I can move a little faster here. Swanson. I'm going to put in his stuff aside. Glasnow. 
Jerks and Profar. Jake Odorizzi. Will Myers is breaking out this year. Finally, he's doing really well. He hit like 295 last time I looked. That's an old card, too. That's out of 2013 Pinnacle. Bowman, Chrome, Dansby, Gesellman, Bradley Zimmer, Prism. All right. Not a bad first stack at all. Got some Yordan, got some Bow. I'm cool with that. On to the second stack. Mullins. Sheffield out of Obsidian. Kopech. Kaboom. Carlos Martinez rookie prism. That's pretty cool. I'll put that aside. I like Carlos Martinez. That dude's had a good career. If you look at his numbers. He's really only struggled like one year in his career. I might be wrong, but that's what I remember last time I looked. Robles. I've been putting his stuff aside. More Robles. Flaherty. Obviously putting his stuff aside. Top five pitcher in the league. Albies. Hoskins. We got a good little streak going right now. Devers. Austin Meadows. I would normally put this aside, but he's kind of uh, not having the best year. Scott Kingery played against him in high school. Robles. Hicks. Calhoun played against him in college. Verdugo. Albies again out of Bowman Platinum. Albies Crusade. Robles Silver Crusade. It's a nice looking card. McMahon. I have like a collection of him going, so I'm just going to put that aside. Swanson. Albies. Albies again. Lots of Albies. You know, I'm okay with that. He's having a slower year this year. Honestly, this is probably a great year to buy Albies because he's having such a slow year. I'm sure his price was a dip. But like I said, that dude is, he gets a lot of hits. He's probably going to be, be up there in the hits conversation by the time his career is over. Cole Tucker played against him in high school. Michael Chavis. I don't know what he's doing this year. Michael Chavis. Kaboom. Griffin Canning. Jake Bowers. Danny Jansen. Obsidian. Some Bowman Chrome. Corbin Burns. He has like a 190 RA this year. Green Kyle Wright. I wouldn't... Would think when he came out of Vanderbilt that I'd be putting that aside, but he hasn't really figured it out. Lizardo. Another bow. What does this one look like? This one looks really nice, actually, based off of the corners. That's very cool. I'm going to put that one aside aside so I can top load it. Actually, I'm just going to top load it right now. I have a top loader right here. All right. Down the road, maybe that's one that we can grade. Awesome. Corner, I mean, that was a quick glimpse, but the corners are good on it, at least. Better than the rest. Jose Martinez. I think Jose Martinez, his career went a different direction than what maybe some people thought. He can hit for sure, though. Jose Ozuna, Al Ford, JT Riddle, AJ Puck. Can't wait to see when he actually hits his stride and really gets a starting spot in that rotation. I think AJ Puck's going to be good. It's like 6 7. Lizardo, McKay, Savali, Sean Murphy's actually been doing pretty good. Well, I'm going to keep his stuff in there. Aquino, not big on him. Gallon, twice. Awesome. So I got two Gypsy Queen and one Heritage. Awesome. Happy about that. Gratterall, Randy Azarina, he's playing pretty good for the Rays. Sweet. Yeah, this is uh, really off to a good start, you guys. I'm really happy with this, especially with that bow that was not beat up at all. The one downfall of only sleeving a lot of cards and, like, moving. I've moved twice this year. I've talked about that on past videos. And sometimes just sleeves don't do the job. So if you think you got a good card, I'd get a top loader for them because I definitely have some cards in my collection that just aren't gradable. They just have banged up corners and stuff like that just from being tossed around over the years fernandez may gallon again awesome horner lizardo and bachette more 2020 here so we can get another yordan or bachette duplantier 
Michael Conforto rookie debut rookie card. Ian Happ. Probably going to uh, potentially sell all my Ian Happ stuff this year, to be honest. he uh, He's playing real well. Mancini, I collect. Vogelback. The name I haven't really heard this year. I know he got traded. I think he's on the Blue Jays now. Freeland. Some rocky stuff there. Nunez, Lugo, Hap again. Out of fire. These cards aren't worth much, but who knows? Maybe there'll be a big time Hap collector. I can just give them all my stuff. Kikuchi, class one. Clint Frazier. Up close, that didn't even look like him in that picture. What it is. Rainbow Foil, Gesellman. Wrong rookie. Some more 2020 here. No bow, though. No Yordan. Tyler Austin. Starling Castro, rookie debut. I didn't even know I had this card. From 2010. He's like the next one in line for 3,000 hits, if you guys didn't know that. He's uh he's getting up there. Banda, Benintendi. It's on the back side of this. Diaz, rookie card. <laughs> Mini. And then two Corey Seagers. Sweet. So we have the flagship and... I think this is probably out of like heritage of some sort or like an insert in like top set. I don't know. Maybe it's an insert in tops. So that that flagship looks really good. I'm going to top load that. It's a good looking card. I like this picture a lot. I don't know why. I think it's a snazzy looking card. And then again, Corey Seager rookie debut. Obviously not as valuable. We're making good time, you guys. 13 minutes in the video. I don't want these to be too long. Sometimes they're too long. All right. Wow. Corey Seager streak. Rookie uh, future stars. Tops Chrome. I don't need to put that aside. It's not worth anything. Kaboom. Will Smith is killing it this year. So I'm excited for that card, actually, because that's out of Tops update. Chrome. Arise. Love Arise. That dude's a beast. David Boat. John Gray, Marlon Max Silver. If he didn't just tear his ACL, or not his ACL, his Achilles, this card would probably be really nice to have. But I, I didn't know I had this card. I would have sold this last year when he actually had a pretty good year. Or maybe it was two years ago, but I for, didn't even know I had that card. AJ Reed, John Gray, Brandon Nimmo. He's actually playing pretty good, but I don't care about him. Alan Mora. Doo -doo. Jamal Williams rookie card. So we did get some football in this. David Polino, Christian Arroyo, Jacoby Jones. Jacoby Jones is breaking out and then he got hurt. He got beamed in the hand, I think it was, and he was out for the year. This is a guy I thought was going to turn out too. Fernando Romero, but we haven't heard of him in a minute, I feel like. Last few cards of the video. Arcia, Brandon Lau, Tops flagship. McNeil opening day. Meadows, Bowman's Best, Austin Nola flagship, Kyle Tucker, I PC him out of Bowman, opening day Grisham, rookie debut Strasburg, and class three Kikuchi. So class three is the best one out of gold label. So that's pretty cool. I still don't collect him or care about him. He hasn't turned out. But that's a cool Strasburg card. Well, guys, that was a pretty good video. Honestly, I, I had a lot of fun with that one. That was definitely the best one yet because I definitely had some PC players in there like Gallon, found some Bows, found some Yordans, found some Flaherty again. Will Myers is one we haven't found yet. Who else? Aaron Savalli, John Means, Refractor, Luke Voigt, which is a big card if it's a PSA 10. I should probably put that in a top loader. It's like over 100 bucks now if it's PSA 10. Ian Happ. Some really good stuff, guys. But really quick, here's probably the top cards value-wise if they were to grade well right now. I think Corey Seager sells for like around 90, if I remember right. Both of these guys were on this week. Baseball cards going up. Luke Voigt and Corey Seager. And then Bo, this card is like 100 bucks too. So, I mean, they all look pretty nice. So, who knows? Maybe I got some value in this video. But yeah, guys, that's going to be it for today's video. That was by far, I think, the best one I've had so far. So... 
Let me know in the comments what you guys think. How did it compare to my last videos that I've sorted through my rookie cards with? And let me know if you guys found anything good while you guys are sorting cards. Hopefully you guys are sorting through your cards because I've definitely let these sit for a while and it's really fun. So if you haven't sorted your cards in a while, go ahead and do that. Anyways, if you guys like this video, please give a thumbs up as always. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And you guys have a great rest of your day. Catch you guys next time. See ya.